Um, I had to make a working model of the kidney to show how the nephrons filter out urine from the blood for my anatomy final project. Um, I started off by researching if anybody had ever done this project before or if they had any ideas and no one had anything or at least not that I could find so decided to make a model and well, I didn't decide to make a model, I had to make a model, um, but I decided to make a video and put it online for anybody else who has to make this project in the future. Um, first out, I'll start by telling you all the materials you need. Um, basic is the wood. This is just a piece of wood right here that I painted to look like a kidney because the model itself of the kidney doesn't really look anything recognizable. So. Um, and then there's this other piece of wood with a little groove cut in it, so you could just slide this piece in here and take it out if you need to do anything to it. Um, and then for the actual working parts, you'll need a glass jar. It should be relatively small. Um, you'll need this poly piping. It's just like some plasticky rubber pipe that you can get at the hardware store. Um, you need some zip ties so you can put the attach it to the board. Um, rubber bands so you can attach all the containers. There's one right here and there's one at the top. Um, it'll probably also be good if you have something to punch holes in wood. We used a drill. I don't know what else you can use but you obviously need holes to attach the zip ties and to put the rubber bands through on the other side. Um, you'll need cotton balls, uh, red glitter, and a siphon pump, which is in the back right here. Um, we used a Gatorade bottle as our heart, kind of, like the pump and the Gatorade bottle combined create the heart. Um, the Gatorade bottle holds the blood, um, yeah. So all the glitter acts as the red blood cells and the water acts as the waste that's being filtered out. And how that works is up at the top, the renal artery right here goes up through the jar and there's holes punctured in the top, which you can't really see because of the cotton balls. But the holes allow the water to flow out. Um, and then eventually the water will collect at the bottom, and which is also the case in the kidney. The water collects in the renal pelvis before it goes through the ureter and into the urinary bladder. So the as it collects, there's a tea bag and some yellow food coloring in here to actually give it the yellow color but it'll come through here, this piping right here, and into the bladder, which is just a cut water bottle. Um, the blood, this, back to the urinary, or sorry, the renal artery, it'll, it just kind of comes up and it's all connected and it comes back down through here into the renal vein. So, and then, of course, the renal vein goes back to the heart because veins go back to the heart and arteries come from the heart, so it pumps in the right direction. Um, you can see under here there have been three holes drilled. Um, these two are the one pipe that is, acts as the renal vein and the renal artery. This one right here is the ureter. Um, it's cut off on the inside. So it's just kind of like attached. And um, that acts so all the water collected will drain through there. Um, to connect them and make sure they don't leak, you have to use a silicone um, thing. And it, you have to let it dry overnight because it takes a long time to dry. Um, so I think that's pretty much it. The cotton balls, if I didn't go over it before, um, act as the extra nephrons, I guess, to filter out any extra glitter that happens to get through the holes. As you can see in our trials, a couple of the glitter pieces have gotten into there, but 
that blocks them from actually going out through the ureter. Because obviously if you have blood in your urine, you have a problem. You should probably get that checked. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. So now I'll demonstrate it. Okay, and if it's been sitting for a while, you're going to want to mix up the glitter in the water so it'll pump through. But once it's all mixed up properly, it'll go ahead. And so all the glitter is pumping through with the water. If it's not, just mix it up some more. As you can see, it'll go through. Um, you can just watch it go through there. And then if any of it comes out through here, you can start to see some of the urine coming down. And it'll all collect in there. See? And it's, of course, yellow, like I said, because of the tea bag. It's over the food coloring. But, and that is the model of the kidney.